big excitement at the Augusta National. The inaugural Augusta National Women's Amateur is equally exciting for the families as it is for the golfers. And for many, today was the first time they got to play the course that they've seen on TV so many times every year in April. News Channel 6's Ashley Osborne is live from the terrace at Augusta National Golf Club. Ashley, you talked to some of the players about their caddy choice after today's practice round. Hey, Jenny, all 72 original qualifiers were assigned an Augusta National caddy. They also brought along a caddy of their choosing. And for many of these women, this week, that person has been their dad. For the first time, the iconic white jumpsuits for Augusta National caddies display the last names of female golfers for a women's tournament. It's everything women's golf needs. Florida Gator Sierra Brooks's dad, not in all white, but still paying close attention to her swing. Your dad's been your caddy all week. Will he be tomorrow? That's still the question that remains a question. <laughs> I'm not really sure yet. Um, that's a tough decision I'm still trying to decide on. I, I do really want him on the bag. She says her dad knows her better than anyone, but when it comes to this course, Augusta's caddy knows best. With some of the breaks, it broke the opposite direction, and the speed. You said this is this one's lightning, and I was like, oh, well, yeah, we'll, we'll see what lightning really is, and it, it sure went off the green. And so, yeah, there was uh, definitely uh, learned a lot with him on the bag, and it was surprising. And those lessons are crucial, considering she's tied for third with Texas Longhorn Caitlin Papp. How long has your dad? been your caddy? Ever since my first tournament when I was 10 years old. Has he ever missed a tournament? Yes, one. <laughs> Only one? Yeah, last summer. <laughs> wow, he's been your caddy all week. Will he be tomorrow? I, I'm not sure. I, I'm leaning towards yes, but yeah, I haven't, I haven't made a 100% decision yet. Her dad encouraging her to make the decision she feels is right. Just think about like what's best for me and honestly I feel like it'd be a really cool experience for him to be on the bag um, since he's been with me through the whole journey of golf. And for that one and only tournament her dad missed, it was her mom on the bag. And it's worked before for another Texas Longhorn to have your dad caddy for you here at Augusta National. You might remember Doug Gim, his dad on the bag the first time he played the Masters, and he won the low amateur.